What's up guys? Welcome back to another episode of Building Success. And today I want to get into the how do we handle a situation when an employee messes up or damages something in a job site. So it's happened to me um, a bunch of times. You know, we have a lot of employees and issues are going to occur. So today I actually had one issue happen. We were installing a glass on a, some glass railings for our stairs and they broke one of the glass, right? The glass shatters, but it doesn't break into little pieces. It's just one panel. So what do we do in that situation? Do we charge the owner for it? Do we take the loss or do we charge the employee for it? Well, in this situation, you are the owner of your business and you're going to have to eat it, right? Most of the time, I take up that loss, right? You're hiring these guys. They're professional. They know what they're doing, but sometimes there's issues that occur. Now, I had a different situation where we were painting a house, and I told my painters, hey, I need you guys to cover all the little hi-hats on the ceiling. Okay, they were small. They were like two inches. And they didn't listen to me. They went ahead and painted without covering it. When I come back and I see that the little hi-hats are painted, I tell them, oh, why didn't you guys cover it? And they said, oh, because the electrician told us not to because they were going to change it. I said, I don't care what the electrician told you. He's not the boss. He's not the one paying you guys. I told you specifically to cover it because the owner said they're not changing it. I don't care what the electrician said. So in that case, yes, I did charge the employees because I specifically told them to cover the hi-hats. And they went against my orders, okay? So if I'm telling the guys what to do and they don't listen, yes, I'm going to charge you for it. So you can learn next time. If I'm telling you to do something, do it how I'm saying. If they would have covered it and then they would have still been have to throw it away or change, well, that's not their problem. But since they didn't listen to me, I charged them for it, okay? It was about $2,000 and I deducted from um, for about like two or three weeks. Every paycheck I was just taking out. You know some money because it was two guys so I, I took from both of them all right um obviously they were mad but hey it's either that or, or leave the job you know I told you exactly what to do in this case with the glass it was an unfortunate um situation it was an accident so I have to eat that up and I pay for it with uh you know my money I have to order another glass so that's how I go about it if you guys have any other way to go about it, please uh, send me a message. Let me know how you would handle it. But that's the way we do. You know, that's the way we do it. So if you guys have any questions, send me a message. Thank you for listening. I appreciate um, everyone that subscribed to my podcast. And uh, thank you guys for watching as well, the guys on YouTube. Take care. Have a great day. And we'll catch you in the next episode.